All right, you guys think it's gonna have enough stopping power to stop quickly? I think it will be. That is very cool, very, very cool. Yep, I like the look of this. Hey guys, welcome to Crawl Unchained for part 6 of my Let's Build a Gunboat series for Starbase. Today I focus mostly on maneuver thrusters and reverse thrusters. Now at some point in this video I will try and use triangle thrusters, but just as always, every time I try to use those triangle thrusters I end up scratching that idea because I just can't figure out a way to fit them on my ship. The ship I'm currently building is just not big enough to use triangle thrusters for maneuvering. I know this means I'll have to add many more maneuver thrusters to compensate and I'm okay with that. The main reason why I'm refusing to add them is because I want the top and bottom of the ship to be mostly clear of obstacles because I want to offer the best line of sight possible for my gunners which will be positioned on top and bottom of the ship. Adding triangle thrusters creates bumps and bulges which will block the view of gunners. Now of course I could just raise the platforms that the gunners are going to be on but at some point I want to limit the size that this ship is going to be. I want to limit the weight of the ship as well, so not an option. Now if I add those triangle thrusters to the sides, then they take the spots that I was going to use for my guns, or they just block the view of my guns. And then, you know, I have to add my guns even further to get clear shots, making my ship even wider in the process. So triangle thrusters are just a huge pain in the butt and I'm just 100% not willing to deal with them on this ship. I did mention 100% here. I know some of you guys have been persistent in suggesting and recommending them. I know you guys might try to change my mind, but I want to put more emphasis on the 100% not willing to deal with them right now. All right. <laughs> now if I ever build a bigger ship then I might consider them again. Now I do plan on eventually using them in the back of this ship to boost my speed because right now I'm not satisfied with the current speed and I'm okay with using them in the back because they won't be blocking my view for my gunners or for my guns. Now towards the end of this video I will discuss some plans that I have to move things around so I can make more room for more generators and things like that. Now that this is all out of the way, let's get to work. Okay, so what I'd like to accomplish today is maneuver thruster placement, maybe finish the shape of, like the general shape of the ship anyway. I'm probably going to keep adding to this moving forward at least up to here I'm gonna extend this further there but I'm gonna have like I'm gonna round off this part here and underneath as well so let's let's just start working
this is this is just too complicated. Too bad. F triangle thrusters. Every time I try to use them, they give me reasons to hate them. I don't want to use them. I'll use them somewhere else. Somewhere that it's not that complicated. I don't like where the hard point is on them. I just don't like them.
So I should have everything I need for pitch, roll, and yaw. To be perfectly honest, I don't think I'm gonna keep the the triangle thrusters there. I don't like it. I I just I don't like them. So now I'm thinking I might find a way to add them to the back. All right. So now I need forward facing thrusters to help me stop. Alright, now comes the tedious part, connecting all of the thrusters I just installed.
like everything here is connected except for this. it at all all right so all that's left for me to do for today for this episode is run the gas pipes on every thruster that's here in the front Hey, is that all my thrusters done? I think so. Yeah. I think that's all my thrusters done. Let's go for a ride. I'm still missing um, side facing thrusters here and here. Like the ship should be able to fly. It might not be like the best actually, no. Um, before I can do anything else, I need to name. And three, six, that's 12. That's another three, six, that's another 12, that's 24. There's another 12 here, that's 36. Plus four, that's 40. Huh. I have too many thrusters. 40 plus 16, I'm at 56 thrusters right now. So I don't have a choice, I need to combine... Combine some thrusters. So you... You're 32... 33... 34... So you're all going to be 32.
Okay. So all this is named. Um, except these, these I'm not gonna name them the same. These, I'm not gonna name them the same either. But these here, yes. Actually, if I do this, I select the whole thing. Yeah, okay. That's what I'm going to do. these using the tool. I'll just select these as well. So this. Name all device fields. Okay, so reset device field names of selected thrusters. Yeah. And then name all device field of selected thrusters. Alright, so I'm definitely thinking about, because of the size of the ship, I'm seriously thinking about adding more generators. I don't think that four generators is going to be enough at this point. This ship is fairly big. And with the amount of thrusters it has, I'm probably not going to add more. Yeah, actually, I, I have to. I'm going to add more of these here in the back. But So that's 12 more maneuver thrusters. But yeah, I'm going to have guns as well, not just thrusters. So, huh, I can't fit here. Yeah, like, I feel like this is about the size that I was intending to make the ship anyways. Like, as I'm walking inside of it, I feel like this is, this is definitely close to the size I intended to make it. So I'm happy with the size. I guess I could give us some light here. Uh, so yeah, I'm happy with the size. What's probably going to happen is because I still have a lot of free space here and probably not that much to put in it. Um, the YOLOL is probably going to be moved probably inside one of these compartments here. So I'm going to have my workbench here, another workbench right there. Uh, the YOLOL are probably going to go in the second compartment. And I'm probably going to move these gas tanks forward a little bit. And then I'll move the other ones forward a little bit to give myself more room for more generators. So that's probably what's going to happen in the next video or whatever, in a future video. This, I'm probably going to extend this pillar to reach the ceiling just so that, you know, it's, it's actually going to add more 
structural integrity, I believe. I don't know. I honestly don't know. Probably. Uh, obviously, the floor is not going to remain like these long beams like that. Uh, I'm going to add like thrusts to join them together. Uh, I'm going to make this more solid for sure. But anyway, for now, this is what we got. I'm at top speed right now, so it's not not super fast. Depending on the amount of window I use, I could have a pretty good view. Like I would like to leave this as a window. This portion as well, like I I want to have a good view, but what I think I'm probably going to do is have some some shields uh, that I can, like if I enter combat mode, then I'm, I'm going to have like corrodium plates just, you know, closing in here, reducing my view, but increasing safety, I guess. Can I still, huh? I don't think I can still pass through here. Oh, I can. Okay, that's that's cool. That is very cool. Very, very cool. Yep, I like the look of this. But yeah, it's going to have more thrusters for sure. Alright, let's see how easily it breaks. Oh, okay. It's it's turning quite easily. I think I'm going to like this ship just as much as I like the Pilgrim. I'm probably going to like this one better because it has a lot more cargo space and it's going to have a lot more weapons. There's a lot more room to walk in it. It's going to be better in every way. Except it's going to be easier to hit, but it's going to have more armor to compensate for that. Can't wait to fly this thing in, in the belt. Can't wait to take it to the PvP zone. And I can't wait to use it with two or three other guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. You guys let me know your thoughts in the comments. All feedback is welcome. Always. You guys take care. I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.